What's up everyone? This is Squigs back with another episode of Squiggy's Rom Hack Romp. Today we have Mario on Southern Continent by KK Koopa. Hmm. Questionable name, but we will proceed forward. Either way. Welcome to the Southern Continent, Mario. This land is known for its natural beauty and hand-drawn graphics. Looks like Peach Gut, you know. Actually, these do look really nice. Very nice hand-drawn graphics. What do we got? Oh, look at this lovely overworld. Looks nice. So we're at Yoshi's house with its sweet blueberries. Wait, why is my house here? Anyway, sorry Mario, but I'm not in this game, so don't bother looking for me, Yoshi. Alright, thanks for the heads up, Yosh. Let's go to... The beginning. Some groovy tunes. I believe this is from Su New Super Mario Brothers U? We Super Mario Brothers 2? I don't know any of the newer ones, to be honest, but I think this is from it. Can I walk right through there? Nope, those ones are solid. These ones you can go through, so that's nice. I think you might be the Loombas, yes. Yay! Come on now. And we'll just kick you along, I suppose, in case we need you. No blocks? Okay. We need a P-switch for that. <laughs> Look at that! Did you draw all this shit, dude? That's fucking impressive. I mean, this looks nice. There's our P-switch. We got our shell back. Did the thing almost disappear? See that shit? Let's see if we can bring this with us. Because why not glitch if you can... If you can. Nope, I missed it. Missed grabbing it. Um, we'll get our little blue... Blue thing. Little warning sign in the background. Love me some Yoshi's Island tunes. Automatic winner in my book. And that was my own stupid fault. Stupid, stupid me. It should not take us very long to get back to where we were. Um, I believe this one had the... No, it was this one down here then. Not too bad. And... Yeah, I'll take that shell. Maybe not, actually. Yeah, maybe I will, buddy. What do you say to that? We're not gonna worry too much about the, uh, coins. Although they would be fun to get, and I believe that's what I'm going for right here, so maybe I'll go back for that other one. I wonder if I can get something cool out of this. What is this? It's a shell? So on the sides, there is... I believe at one side I could get a key, but that wouldn't do me any good. And the other side might be Yoshi Wings, which also won't do me any good. Okay, we got the, uh, the P-Switch this time. I don't think it's gonna help us, but it is ours, so that's nice. And let's see if we can make this jump much easier, now that we're expecting it. Alright, so we got our P-switch for no reason. And let's see if we can... nope, we don't need that. Actually, let's bring this shell. More useful than the P-switch that we're not going to need anyways. Because you can drop it on things. Oh, hey you, what were you doing in there? Are you something good? You, uh, on a slant makes it very hard to do, so maybe you are nothing anyways. I would really like some fire flowers. <sighs> okay. I'll kill you, Mr. Chuck. <laughs> what a strange looking Rex. I like it, though. So we bounced on one of these, which leads me to believe... Why, though? Why are some of these like this? Oh, there we go. Now, usually when there's some that don't break, it's because you want to... Aw, oh, man, I kind of want to get them all now. I did not go for it, though, so it's too late. Just random ones. Okay, we had to search, you know. Take a look around. Hey, now. Aw, oh, man, I really want the shell. I feel safer with the shell. You know how it goes. <laughs> I like those, too, the graphics for the, uh... The... Piranha Plants, I guess you'd call them. I think they have a name, don't they? I don't really know. It's strange that I don't know that one. Alright, that was an enjoyable first level, I think. It looked beautiful, it played nice. Should've got all five of those damn coins, I'm such a fool. But, uh... All in all, that was very fun. So... What do we got? Sundown Stroll. This one should be pretty good. 
Oh, it's got that music that I always hear, and I never know where this is from. Maybe it's also from New Super Mario Wii Brothers U2. <laughs> I'm not sure, though. Okay, this time we're going for him. Why not? And we got something else here. A bunch of those just coin blocks, it seems. Okay, don't need you. Don't need you. I will take you. Um. Okay. Ah, oh, I missed my jump. Do we have any power-ups? Please. Nope. Get out of the way, buddy. I figured there would be something hidden in the middle there. I don't know. It was just... It was lined up to, to show it. Where'd my song go? There we go. Sorry about that. Technical issues. You know how it goes. And... Ah, oh, come on now. I'll be back for you, buddy. Don't think you're safe. We'll be back twice as strong. What do we got? Um... Can't remember which one of these is, uh... Yeah, never mind. I'm not going for the coins. I will. One slightly out of my way, and I'm like, nah, fuck it. I know it's there. <laughs> okay. We're gonna bring our shell with us. No! Okay. Good, good. Two coins. Bring our shell with us. Bring our shell. Ah, uh, No more shell. That's fine. That will be fine. Are you... Nope, nothing to help us. Okay, we got three little bouncies here. This guy has to die for killing us last time. Thank you. And we'll leave you to tell your friends what happens when you kill Mario. <laughs> I like these little fly- All the graphics in this are fucking amazing. I can't believe someone did the graphics themselves and actually had the ability to make good levels, too. That's rare, I would think. <laughs> I would think you'd be good at one or the other, usually. All right. Not necessarily, but just, I mean, it's two good skills to have, is I guess what I'm saying. So, this leads us to some foresty area. Oh my god, is this icy? It is. That fucking tripped me up. I almost died there. <sighs> Take a pipe to the icy world, then it's like temperate when you come back out. <laughs> Alright. Okay, more coins that we don't need, and I don't think I've ever gotten that many from one of those blocks. Usually I see it's one of those blocks and just get disappointed and leave, huh? Okay, now we're talking. We got plenty of fireballs. Fireballs in reserve, more than we know what to do with. We got all five of the coins, and we finished the level. Not bad, if you ask me. So, let's just speed this up a little. Go to Shiny Rock Grotto. Check out what this has to offer. You probably know this already, but just remember, you, that a red level icon meets level has two exits. If you didn't know that by now, well, you trail off a lot this hack, Mr. Hack Designer. <laughs> okay. So we'll keep our eyes out for a nice, um... Oh, you spiny motherfuckers. No, you're not spinies, you die. You're buzzy beetles. Yes, you are. You buzzy motherfuckers. This echo is weird. Okay, come on now. I should have just kicked that a long time ago. Maybe not. Maybe not. Alright, let's give that another go. For real this time, with feeling. So... Do we have something here? Yeah, it's right here. That's nice. Gotta start you out with the power-up. Very nice level designer. Okay, that was a bad beginning. Oh my god. I thought I could keep running and see if I could get some sort of chain one-ups, but I, I guess I forgot the landscape instantly. You know, I should be more careful because if I run out of lives, I'm probably fucked and I'll have to start redoing levels, so... Uh, we don't want that. And as such, we will be more careful in the future by skipping the power up and sliding to our death instantly. Well done. 
Okay, so we're gonna get the power up. Not even land on the slanted slope. There we go. Pretty good. Pretty good, kinda. Yeah, I, I knew there was a one-up somewhere. I got another one from jumping off it, too, which is nice. Okay, that'll be good, actually, from now on. And if I bring... it, If I bring even another one with me... I can get three one-ups if I bring the shell with me and kick it into that first shell. So that'll be good in case I die. I can at least start getting my one-ups back. That's something I need to think about building more into my levels, is one-up tricks and stuff like that to give people a fighting chance. I like to put up... That's weird, the way that that was done. <laughs> but I like to put, um... Like a three-up moon hidden in every one of my levels is kind of like an extra bonus challenge. But I don't usually put too many, like, one-up opportunities. What are you? Are you a Monty Mole? Took me a while to process what was going on. Monty Mole! What does that mean? Green? Oh, it's got a little power bar! That's awesome! Well, that... I mean, that was looking to set me up. I just wouldn't have it. <laughs> like, I didn't let them save my life there, so I only got myself to blame. Now, let's see if we can get this one-up trick again. Well, first, we don't... Don't worry about this part. Yeah, we take this guy right here and bring, us, bring him with us. Damn it. I fucked up everything by bringing that guy with us. So, next time, we won't worry about that. That was bad. That was bad. Um... I don't think we're getting any more power-ups, which is unfortunate. Did I miss this last time? Weird. Um, okay. Alright. Um... That was the worst timing ever. It was like I was trying to kill myself. It was perfect timing for that, but... Oh my god, like, I could have landed anywhere else. There's a wide range of safe times and a small range of very dangerous times, and I chose one of those for some reason. Well, this time, the one-ups, I think... Oh my god. I think they will go better than last time. Oh my god. Okay, let's try this again. Wait till these guys get up there. There we go. Three one-ups. That's exactly what we're talking about. And then, get rid of that guy, because he's scary, and he does not sleep like the turtles do. Oh, I wonder if I can jump directly on those guys. I think they're the footballs, so they should... I believe you can just jump on top of the footballs. Um, I guess we'll try this again. Oh my god, what is wrong with me? Why is that the hardest part? I'm all freaked out by it now. Oh, we took a bullet for our lives, but it worked. It worked out anyways. Oh my god, I really almost didn't make that. I probably shouldn't have made that. All truth be told. Okay, this time, I got a new plan. So, right, we got this problem here. We alleviate it by shooting it. Like that. <laughs> it seems like worse, but it was better for some reason. Okay, and we got for all of our efforts a coin, which are well placed in this hack and make me want to get them, so I will continue trying. Okay, there's our secret exit. We got the coins for it. Now we need to get the... the uh, P-switch in order to drop that down. Okay, that's doable. Is this... where is this exactly? Did this bring me further on in the level? It did. Okay, get out of here, Monty. Okay. And now, we just wait. Thank you so much. Now, that looks like the secret to me, down there. But, I guess... 
Yeah, I'm just gonna go forward, I guess, and see if this is if it's the regular exit. We'll come back for the secret, but um, I'm pretty sure that one's probably the secret exit because it's harder to get into. But we can get the regular exit this time with all the dragon coins. That'll be nice. That will be nice. This should be the end. Hey, 30 bonus stars. I missed one of the dragon coins, though. It's probably in that pipe. If I had to guess, I'd say it's in that pipe. Wouldn't you? <laughs> Um, okay, let's try that once more. No, I don't want to go here. Don't look. Don't look. You didn't see any of this. Surprise for later. That's so fucking satisfying. I need to put more shit like that. Okay, I have confirmed that you could jump on their stupid heads at least. So that's not too bad. And then basically all we have to do is go through here safely. And I didn't even check over here. The exit if you fuck it up, I guess. Oh no. I thought there was a separate exit up there for some reason, but there's not. It's just you exit this exit from a weird spot way up, way up high. Okay, so now if we make that second one, I think we will be good to go. Okay, it had to be done. Had to be done. This one's not too bad. Should I go down with this platform? Or should I just make the leap off the, the slanted platform? I'm gonna go off the slanted one. Really not that hard at all. And we're in. We get a P-switch. Yes, we do. Thank you so much. And it brings us out back at the start. That's beautiful. We've unlocked a secret area. This is exciting, folks. It's exciting. What do we got here? A yellow switch zone. Oh, I love the switch palaces. But I'm out of time, unfortunately. So we'll have to save that for next time. Hope you enjoyed this episode, friends. Hope you have a wonderful afternoon. And hope to see you when we conquer the yellow switch zone. And the mysterious ghost house that you definitely didn't see.